this time, inventors from all around the world gather in Waterbury, Connecticut for the Yankee Invention Convention. They meet with manufacturers and distributors. They try to sell their ideas. They try to sell their inventions. We thought, why pitch to just a few executives when we can pitch to our cameras and to you, the American public, directly? Some of these ideas didn't sell, but some did. These are all real inventors pitching their invention. In fact, one you're going to see has already had sales worth over $100,000. You try and guess which one in this next installment of Pitch to America. Hi, I'm Q. N. DeWine from Chicago, Illinois. And what I have here is a solid soap pocket washcloth. What this washcloth allows you to do is to have continuous soap lather while bathing. You place this bar of soap in the pocket here, and just as easy as it is to place in the pocket, it can be removed with the same ease. This soap will stay in the pocket during the bathing process. It won't shake out, it won't fall out. This pocket holds up to an eight ounce bar of soap, which is a very large piece of soap that uh, I usually use to clean horses with. Now, you want to have bar of soap blues while bathing. And what happens is, because bathing is such a personal thing, we don't discuss those frustrations with anybody else. So we keep it to ourselves. And now we have all of this frustration built up inside when we're bathing. Well, this product will eliminate the frustrating blues that you have from using bar of soap. Hi, my name is Larry Larson, and uh, I'm basically an insignificant inventor. This is my first try, and believe me, it's going to be my last financial try. But here we have what I call the Larson lock. These particular lock nuts, you cannot put it on, you cannot take it off without the deciding factor of the Craftsman socket wrench. You can move it either way, but you take off the socket and then you try to turn it, you cannot move it, which hopefully will change the entire texture and flavor of the nut and bolt industry and increase safety beyond measure. Hello, my name is Pal Asija, and this is my son, John Asija. This invention is a snowball maker for a fair fight, fast snowball fight. It makes 60 snowballs a minute. John, what was your reaction when you first played with it? I love it. It makes a snowball fight 100 times better. <laughs> Introducing Vitality 6 and Pack, the new alternative to smoking, drinking, and drugs. Finally, a healthy choice for teenagers, young adults, and all ages. In addition, due to recent stress in America, 50% of Americans are suffering from stress. As a result, we finally did something about that. We got a Vitality Stick. Not only does it have purified air and oxygen, it also has aroma, and it also has oxygen that you could purify your skin with and prevent aging, blemishes, you name it, it's a multi-sensory stimulator. My name is Howard Williams. My name is Kevin Morris. And we have invented the Lenswear hat. How many times have you been working in the yard and bend over and your glass, sunglasses fall off or lose them over the boat fishing? But well, we've solved that problem. You simply take your glasses, slip them right in, <laughs> and never lose them. Hi, my name is Chris McCullers. And I'm Mario Williams. And we have an invention called the pole holder. It's a lightweight, hands-free fishing pole holder that actually keeps your hands free when you're rebaiting your hook or taking your fish off the line. Unfortunately, we're in a gymnasium right now, so I don't have, can't give you a demonstration, but I do have a tape. Oops, there goes that expensive fishing rod. Up, up your rod, your fish, up, under your arm. Introducing Poho, the new revolutionary light tackle fishing rod holder. You've seen the tape, get the Poho. <laughs> Hi, my name is Dave D'Alessandro. And I'm Adam Tesser, and this is our Ostrich 3-in-1 chair. 
Dave's going to tell you a little bit about it right now. What we have is a regular beach chair. It's also a reclining five position lounge chair. You can extend a footrest up at various angles. It also reclines fully back into a horizontal position. In addition to that, we have a face cavity. You lay down like this, place your face into the cushions. You can even read a book. And it's also quite comfortable and good for the neck and back. Hi, my name is Julia Rhodes, and my product is a clean slate attachable eraser for the dry erase markers. Uh, it used to be that you would have a marker, you'd write on your, you would write on your whiteboard, and then you'd go to erase, and you ended up with black hands. So you, all of a sudden there was this black finger disease plaguing Americans. So now, instead of having to use your hand, you're able to just make a mistake and erase, like a pencil on the end of an eraser. Hi, Jay. My name is Sam Sorgen. My invention is the dual field sunglasses. As you know, with regular sunglasses, you have to keep taking them on and off when you go into a bright or sunny con or shady condition. With these, all you have to do is just tilt your head upward to see clearly, downward to get the benefit of the sunglasses, and it's much safer as you're driving. You don't have to constantly take them on and off. Thank you. The one that sold over hundred thousand dollars in sales for these the hat, the sunglasses with the hat. A hundred grand. Be right back with Kate Winslet right after this.